Hello everyone, it's Jessica Wilkinson, your Young Adult Services Librarian, and for this week's Teen Book Talk, I'm going to talk about some of the new books that can be found in the teen space. So let's get started. The first one is Batman and Psychology by Travis Langley. Batman is one of the most compelling and enduring characters to come from the golden age of comics. An interest in his story has only increased through countless incarnations since his first appearance in Detective Comics No. 27 in 1939. Why does the superhero without superpowers fascinate us? What does that fascination say about us? Batman and Psychology explores these and other intriguing questions about the mass vigilante including, does Batman have PTSD? Why does he fight crime? Why is a vigilante? Why the mask, the bat, and the underage partner? Why are his most intimate relationships with bad girls he ought to lock up? And why won't he kill that homicidal green-haired clown? This book gives you fresh insights into the complex inner world of Batman and Bruce Wayne and the life of characters of Gotham City. It also explains psychological theory and concepts through the lens of one of the world's most popular comic book characters and is written by a psychology professor and super herologist. The next book is Belle Morte by Bella Higgin. There's only one way out. Belle Morte. One of the five houses where vampires reside as celebrities and humans are paid to be their living donors. While others came here seeking fortune, I came in search of my sister who walked into Belle Morte five months ago and never walked back out. Now that I'm here, the secrets about this world have proven to be much bigger than I ever anticipated, and lurking around every corner are shocking insinuations of what happened to my sister. There's only one person who might have the answers I need, and the undeniable pull I feel towards him is terrifying. Edmund Dante's a vampire, and my mortal enemy. The harder I try to resist him, the further I fall under his spell, and in one instant my life is irrevocably changed, my past becomes prologue, and my fate becomes sealed behind these doors. Belmorte has spoken, and it may never let me go. The final book I'm going to talk about today is The Library of the Dead by T. L. Huchu. When a child goes missing in Edinburgh's darkest streets, young Ropa investigates. She'll need to call on Zimbabwean magic as well as her Scottish pragmatism to hunt down clues. But as shadows lengthen, will the hunter become the hunted? When ghosts talk, she will listen. Ropa dropped out of school to become a ghost talker. Now she speaks to Edinburgh's dead, carrying messages to the living. A girl's gotta earn a living, and it seems harmless enough. Until, that is, the dead whisper that someone's bewitching children, leaving them husks empty of joy and life. It's on Ropa's patch, so she feels honor-bound to investigate, but what she learns will change her world. She'll dice with death, not part of her life plan. Discovering an occult library and a taste for hidden magic, she'll also experience dark times for Edinburgh hides a wealth of secrets, and Ropa's gonna hunt them all down. 
These are just three of the new reads that can be found in the teen space, so be sure to come on in and check them out. Thank you.